Some tough but successful negotiations with the mm -hmm. Russians. Now comes the Senate. Mm -hmm. You have no doubt you're going to get the eight Republicans you need to ratify this treaty. Well, you know, the, uh, uh, listen, I've now been in Washington for uh, long enough that uh, for me to say I have no doubt <laughs> about how the Senate operates would be foolish. When they have had the opportunity to fully evaluate this treaty, we'll come to the conclusion that this is in the best interest of the United States. Sarah Palin taking aim at your decision to restrict uh -huh. uh, use of nuclear weapons, uh, your pledge not to strike nations, non-nuclear nations, uh, who abide by the non-proliferation treaty. Here's what she said. She said, it's unbelievable. No other administration would do it. And then she likened it to kids on a playground. She said, you're like a kid who says, punch me in the face, and I'm not going to retaliate. Yeah. Your response? Uh, I really have no response to that. The last I checked, Sarah Palin's not much of an expert on uh, nuclear uh, issues. But the strain of criticism has been out there among other Republicans as well. They think you're restricting use of nuclear weapons too much. Uh, and what I would say to them is, is that if the Secretary of Defense uh, and the Chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff are comfortable with it, I'm probably going to take my advice from them and not uh, from Sarah Palin.